Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 4. And this was actually my third or fourth attempt, so I did actually grind a few levels out. I did fuse Nico Shogun, as you see there. Nico Shogun is combined by making uh, Kusi Matama, Ari Matama, Saki Matama, and one other Matama. It's a cross fusion. It's really not that hard to get, if I can manage it. And he's extremely, extremely useful for this boss fight. He has a ton of resistances, and he actually has Meteorama. And you will need Meteorama. Well, maybe not need, but if you do not have Meteorama, as I found out, you're going to be using a lot of magical restoratives. The time I did not, I, got, I had to kill the first form, I think, around four times. And I use all my Snuff Souls, I use my Soma, and then I realized, oh yeah, I don't want to use all that, so I went and grinded a little bit. You can easily do it without Meteorama, but like I said, you're going to use all of your SPMs, because if you do not use them, you have to heal more often. And in this fight, offensive, you know, offensive rushing is what you need. To have more offensive rushing, you have to have bigger group heals. And yes, I want the Bravery Vessel on Yukiko, because you do not want her feared. You want her to cure fear, and make sure she does not get feared. Anyway, here we go. And this is the instance where I said, oh, make sure you get that, because if you do not get the Orb of Flowing Darkness, or whatever the Orb of Darkness, you will not be able to actually open that door. And I'd go all the way back. Look! There he is! You, Mitsuo? You better be ready to pay, you bastard! Wait, Kanji! Something's not right. Everyone gets on my nerves! That's why I did it! What do you think of that? Say something, damn it! <sighs> Nobody even thought of me after the first two people. That's why I went for the third one! I killed them! What are you all quiet for? Because... I feel nothing. What are you talking about? Make sense, dammit! What the...? Well, which one's the shadow? I... have nothing. I am nothing. And you... are me. What? What's that supposed to mean? I'm... I'm not nothing! No! If this keeps up... Who are you guys? How'd you get in here? Damn it! Who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Shut the hell up! We came after you! Are you the killer? <laughs> I am! I'm the one behind everything! I don't give a damn what this imposter's saying! <laughs> you hear that? You have nothing to do with me! Get out of my sight! That goes for the rest of you, too! Why'd you chase me all the way here? I'll kill you! I'll kill all of you! I can do it, you know! I can do anything! So you don't accept me. What the? Damn it, here we go again. Get ready, everyone. Once we beat him, this case is as good as closed. And welcome to what a great many people consider one of the hardest boss fights in Persona 4. And it's not hard to see why. You'll have to destroy the outer shell first. Yes, this boss has phases. You have to destroy the awesome 8-bit shell, or is that 16 bit? Either way, you have to destroy that and then hit the boss. <laughs> For 
Remember when I said you have to rush? Yeah, you have to rush. Here goes! Persona! If you do not rush, you'll probably run out of SP at some point in the fight. Now the reason I'm using spells here is because the outer shell actually is weaker to spells. Go figure, a bunch of blocks being weak to magic. And you will learn to love that. That sound right there. Or you won't, and yeah. The bombs are the most annoying part in this whole fight. He loves spamming them. And you have to get rid of that, so I really, really recommend you bring at least a few royal jellies. If you do not bring royal jellies, you are in for a ride. It is not exactly a fun ride either, because then you have no SP to work with. But yes, as you see, if I had not had Meteorama on Yukiko and tried to heal, it would have taken two turns of people casting Media. And even then, I wouldn't be fully healed. As opposed to just having the one with Meteorama, so I'm free to, you know, attack more often. Which is exactly what you need in this fight. Now that we've gotten the strategy out of the way, the strategy completely changes once that this phase is done. But for now, let's focus on getting this phase done, shall we? Once the shell is gone, then you can focus on more physical attacks from Chie and Kanji if you so wish. You just really want him to attack. If you think this is annoying so far, <laughs> no, not yet. Hang in there, senpai. No, the fight gets worse if you allow it to drag on. Oh yes, much worse. I wish I could say I was joking. I'm not. A few more attacks. This thing should be gone out of its shell. Ah. You know what? Screw it. I don't really need Kanji's SP. I only have a limited amount of royal jellies, so you know what? Screw it. Anyway, this thing's about to go down, so I'm going to buff up. Because once this shell goes down, you go all out attack mode. Because this thing will reform. You want to get as much damage as you can before it reforms, obviously. Just as a point of reference, how much damage that does, not very much. Here's our chance. Let's go. Gotcha. This is it. And now is your chance to actually do damage against the main boss. And take advantage of it. I am thou. After you get yourself situated. Aw, oh, you jerk. Now pay, pay attention to what he does there. If it's a white veil, he's going to use ice attacks, so you want Yukiko to guard. If it's a green veil, or whatever it is, then you want Kanji to guard. Whatever he veils up is what he's going to cast and spam Magura of, or Maga... Moss veils of, sorry. Yeah. Anyway, now that I'm protected... Beat the crap out of it. Here goes! Persona! Well, that was actually not that underwhelming. I expected much worse, but alright. Oh, this is bad. Kanji's useless. If you do not guard... 
with whoever's going to be weak. He will cast Megiddo afterwards, I think, or some other horrible non-damage type or non-element type, and it will probably kill somebody in the party. It's very hard. It's just one of those, oh, you screwed up, oh, you're gonna pay for it, and you're gonna pay for it hard. And it's a, it, I appreciate it. it. Keeps you honest as a gamer. You gotta remember, don't screw up. Of course, I got very lucky there. I screwed up, but thankfully, it didn't bite me in the ass. Yukiko, being a very good, you know, dodger, managed to get out of the way of the eyes. She shouldn't have, but thankfully she did. Anyway. Here goes! Uh, this is going on a bit longer than I imagined it would. You know, normally, they, uh, he starts rebuilding his shell by now. It's actually quite a, uh, quite a good turn of events. Now, once he casts Whisper, it all changes. You can go completely all out. And you can destroy it while it's rebuilding, yes, but you have to hurry. Since he gets two turns, he can just rebuild it next turn if he wants. But you got to hurry. Don't strain yourself. If you do manage it though, it really helps. Because then he falls down again and you get another all-out attack. But he is being very, very quick to cover his bases here. One more, and he is back to full. And that's not good. Persona. Come on, break. Kanji, you gotta... Persona. Much as I would love for you to actually go all out and hit him, I kinda need you to not die. Go. What the Break, darn it. Uh, I am now. Oh, crap. <laughs> now, if you do not cure this, Jesus, I'm scared. you will die. Next turn. But there's a plan. I have a cunning plan. Persona! You have to cure this, or whoever's afflicted will die. I am thou. And that means an instant game over for me. Aw, oh, you dig? Of course, the worst part is, no, yeah, you lose turns. I'm with you. It gets exceedingly annoying. Why won't you break? I am thou. Would you stop spamming that? Oh, for God's sake. Well, la di da. Yeah. He thought it was bad before. Uh, no, no, no. Now he has an AoE. Gigadine, or Megadine, or whatever that said. So, yes, in one turn he can AoE you and put an exhaustion on your healer. 
I hope your main character has Meteorama, or at least media. Because if not, whoops. I am thou. You're seeing why I said you might want to have Meteorama for this fight? Yeah, it wasn't for the first phase, it was for this. Here goes Persona! Now you can, you know, avoid this whole thing by keeping him in his baby form if you have Black Frost or something, but still. For those of us without it, we gotta make do. After all, it just wouldn't be very fun to watch me, like, two-shot this boss with Black Frost, would it? No. You wanna watch a guy struggle to manage to beat this thing, not two-shot it with Augie Dime? Or whatever Dime spell. But if you can, Black Frost is very nice to have in this fight. I believe he's made with... A pentagon shape? Fusion? I don't know. I think Ghoul and like all the Jack Frost, King Frost, Pyro Jack, and whatever the other, you know, Jack is named. Yeah, anyway, sorry for the off topic there, but I'm just saying if you want an easy way, that's how you make it. So anybody else getting tired of that noise? Yeah, it'll grow on you. Seriously, it does. I don't know how, but it does. I actually quite like that sound. But maybe that's my old school gamer kicking in. Thank you. Oh, halfway through phase one again. I am now. And this is getting dicey because I'm having to heal more and more, and I don't really like that. Mainly due to the fact that I'm running out of SP. Here goes. And that's never a good thing to run out of SP in a boss fight. But as long as you keep the pressure up, you should be fine. I hope that applies here. Why can't I dodge? Good, good Yukiko. Keep dodging like the wind. Okay. I need to recover some SP here, so we're getting Fortuna out. It's not nearly as effective as Undin or Nico Shogun, but I gotta get some SP back. Slow and steady wins the race, eh? Ah. Come on, attack. Aww. I never dodge the bombs. This is awful. Okay, uh... Everybody's running out of SP, so I guess I'm gonna have to cure Chihei here. I need somebody with SP to cast. Because I 
because it does do quite a bit of damage, as you see there. That's, a, that's your best source of damage in its first form. Come on. Oh, thank God. There. Wow, thank you, Yukiko. Clutch. And this should do it right here, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs>